In this problem, we're being asked to find the domain of the function. So this is a square root function. Uh, whenever there's not a number here, there's really an invisible two. And so the trick is whenever this number, this is called the index, is even, you take this and you set it greater than or equal to zero. So if you're looking for the domain, um, that's always the first step whenever you have a root function with an even index. So take this and do that. If it's odd, the answer is all real numbers. You don't have to do any work. Then we just have to solve this uh, for x. So we'll subtract 5, subtract 5. That gives us, let's see, um, 4x greater than or equal to negative 5. And then we would just divide by 4, divide by 4. And that would give us x greater than or equal to negative 5 over 4. And to write our answer in interval notation, what you can do if you want is draw a picture. So here's negative 5 fourths. And it's all of the numbers bigger than that. So they're all, it's all the ones over here. And we have an equal to piece, so we're including it. So we use a bracket, and the bracket opens towards the shading. Okay. So now from this picture, you can get the answer. It would, it would be bracket negative 5 over 4 comma infinity. And that, my friends, would be the domain of this function. Good luck.